Hello, hello, it's Brandy Janae. Thank you guys so much for tuning in with me today for my first ever Vlogmas. I said last year that I was going to do it. And so this year I decided to go ahead and go for it. Now I know that a lot of people do the whole like 25 days or 31 days or whatever. I'm only gonna do 12 because that's about all the day-to-day -day videos I've got in me right now, but I'm going to commit. So here is day one of Vlogmas and in today's video I'm going to be sharing with you my planner lineup so be sure to stick around like this video subscribe to my channel and I'll be back Okay, thank you guys again for joining me today. Welcome if you are new, welcome back if you're returning. I truly appreciate you. Like I said, this is my first ever, um, I think I said Vlogmas, I didn't mean that. I meant plan miss because this is going to be pretty much all things planner related. So I don't plan on doing any like face-to-face -face vlogs. We'll see, I don't know, I got 12 days, so we'll see how that goes. But anyway, plan miss, in case I said it wrong the first time, that's what I meant. So again, we have our 2023 planner lineup. This year, I am going to be using these two beauties. So we'll start with the smaller of the two, which is my everyday carry in this beautiful Moterm cover. And the color is like a teal, greenish, blue kind of thing, turquoise, I don't know. Anyway, but it's really pretty. It's like a Moterm like zip cover. So inside, I just have a few like stickers and then this cute little die cut sticker from, I think this is from Ohana Story maybe. And then in the side, I keep like cards and things like that. This beautiful Be Kind bookmark is from Erin Condren. Of course, here is my Hobonichi cousin. And I got some little things in here. So this is from the Coffee Monsters Co. This is from the Happy Planner. This sticker is from Mandy Lynn Plans. And then this is like a bookmark that I purchased, well, yeah, that I purchased from a bookstore in Ohio when I was there on a trip. Of course, I have all of my tabs from the Coffee Monsters Co., which I absolutely love. And I even started doing the little like washi thing back here for the washi that I've used so far. I have like my cars and money and all that stuff in the back. And then over here, I have been using this pen here, which I don't know the name of it. I also purchased this from a shop in Ohio. And yeah, it's just been good to use so far because it dries quickly. So I'm able to just kind of write things down and not have to worry about the smear because this is literally, as you can see, my wallet. So I don't really have like a lot of wait time. So, so far I'm really enjoying this. Did I set up for, I don't remember if I set up for, Oh, I did put some December things. So I'm not really a monthly calendar person, especially in a calendar this size. So right now I've just been kind of putting stickers here to let me know that I have something going on that day on the off chance that I actually reference this book, this page. Like I said, it doesn't happen very much. This little cute bookmark is from the Coffee Monsters Co. So theoretically, I will actually look at it. But honestly, this is the first time I've looked at it since I set it up. So we'll see. So anyway, that is my Hobonichi Weeks. I absolutely love it and I'm super excited to continue using it throughout this year. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed that this is the only planner lineup <laughs> that I'm actually going to be using this year, but if you're in the planner world, you know how it goes. So Next up, I am going to be attempting to use this beautiful, again, Moterm cover. And this is the Hobonichi Cousin, which I absolutely love. I think it is beautiful the way I have it set up. So I have some more, like, this is actually packaging from the Coffee Monsters Co. Advent Box <laughs> that I just kind of cut up and stuck in these pockets. And then I have these stickers here from, I don't remember where they're from. Oh, Cupcakes and Stickies. So it's just like some drops, some circles, some little dots, and then some like script stickers. And then of course, if you watched my video before, you saw me already decorate this. I do think I added, 
this bloom where you are planted sticker from live love posh since i did the initial setup this name came i don't remember what shop it was now but anyway i ordered something from one of the sticker shops and they wrote my name beautifully on the envelope so i did cut that out and just stick it in here it's not stuck so it's just here and then again this paper is packaging from the coffee monsters co advent box i added this clear pocket here and then put some stickers on and then this little card is from the from aaron condren I think it's some of the freebie cards that come when you order planners. But I really want this book to not only have like journaling things, but I really want this to just, just be like beautiful and self-care like because it's going to also serve as a journal for me. So again, I did set up a monthly. Will I use it? probably not but it looks good <laughs> which is what really matters so i did set up the monthly and i love the way that it looks and i am so excited to start using this i think oh yeah on december 26 i cannot wait i'm so excited and then in the back of this book i have added because i know some things have changed so there's movies to watch tracker and then this books to read tracker and both of these trackers came from planner kate and i am actually because it is december i am going to actually start writing on these now as i go watch movies and i read different books so i'm going to go ahead and start doing these now that's my pen test i don't think i've added anything else no and then i just have some like uh more squares things from coffee monsters co I'm sorry, from Cloth and Paper. Then I added my cards from Coffee Monsters Co. And then some more like dots and things that I just have back here. I never ever use these either. So I keep hoping that if I carry them around enough, I'll actually use them. We'll see. So anyway, this is my planner lineup for 2023. The Hobonichi Weeks, Hobonichi Cousin. <sighs> let's see we'll see how it goes i'll keep you posted as always throughout the year if i decide to change anything but i'm super excited i even got my first fountain pen so that when i'm doing my journaling i can use this i'm so excited about it. it's from a, one of the Kueco sport pens and this came from may over at black mountain sticker so i'm super excited to use that in this planner like i said this one it's going to be like pretty much all ballpoint because I need to write and go. <laughs> so anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Again, be sure to stick with me throughout this 12 days for Plan Miss. I may not mention it in some of the other videos because I already had them kind of scheduled to film before I decided to do this. But we just we're just going to lump them all in there together because I don't want to refilm them. So anyway, thank you so for much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Be sure again to like it if you have not already done so. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you have not already done so. And I'll see you in the next video. As always, have a good day, friends. Goodbye.